Hello there, this is uh, Tom from MagnaCAD. Today I wanted to show, I'm coming across an example here which we thought would be a good video to show you how to use the advanced handles in IronCAD. So here we are, we're building a Dutch style uh, framework for a shed and this comes up quite often so I figured let's do a video. Um, we have the two by fours here. We're building these these uh, cross members, and you can see a lot of people. Now we want to get the cut angle on this to to come and mate with this part here. All right. Um, the first question people say is, well, how do I get the end of this board at this intersection? that doesn't really exist. There is really no hard exist uh, intersection here that you can snap to because it's two separate parts. So the trick with that is, is you reorientate your shape handles. And this is what this video is all about. So let me show you. So again, the goal is to bring this, uh, the length of this two by four right to this intersection here. Okay. So how you do that is we'll pick the two by four we want our shape handles so we hit the tab key so the first thing I want to do is I want to make this uh, handle perpendicular to this face so what we do is we right click and we come down below this line there's all the advanced options <coughs> so we go to the handle orientation perpendicular to that face and you see it changes and now the next thing I want to do is move the handle to this corner so I'll right click on the handle get it and s change the snap point of the handle to this corner here it won't physically move but it does turn white it's a little hard to see but when it's white it indicates you see it shows you where the let me if I zoom in a little bit you can see it better so when you hover over it you see you get the white dot indicating that's really where the handle is so now we have the handle here and it's perpendicular to this face so now we can just right click and say snap to anywhere on that face and you see it perfectly it's that intersection okay and then you can do the same with all the other pieces so this is just a quick video to show you how to do that without having to do all kinds of geometry gymnastics to get where this intersection is hope you find this useful and uh, if you have any comments Put them down below or reach out to me at tom at magnacad.com. All right, have a great day.